few details about the consumption of the Paschal offering. There is a negative mitzvah that the Paschal offering should not be boiled in water or underdone. It should be fully roasted in order to eat. Another mitzvah is that, as we mentioned yesterday, a few people join together on one animal, which is their offering, and they all convene together in one home where they eat from it. And there's a negative mitzvah that they are not to take it out of that space. Another mitzvah is that an apostate may not eat from the Paschal offering. He's titled in the Torah as a stranger. There is a verse that states that no foreigner or servant should eat from it, meaning a non-Jew should not eat from the Paschal offering, even if he works in the Jew's home and keeps in the seven Noahide laws. Another negative mitzvah is that an uncircumcised Jew should not eat from the Paschal offering. And another mitzvah is that the bones of the animal are not to be broken. In addition, there's a mitzvah regarding the second Passover offering, which is brought a month later for those who missed the first. As we mentioned yesterday, no bones are to be broken in that either. Thank you for watching.